Marvel created a comic book series in 1970s called What If, which focuses on events in the Marvel universe that might have unfolded if a few key moments in history turned out differently. When the Hulk was first introduced in the comics, he was green-skinned due to printing error with four-color printing process. Did you know the public knew about Tom Holland's casting as Spider-Man before he did? Holland stated in an interview with Ellen that during his last audition, he was told that they would reveal the final cast the next day. However, six weeks passed and he had not been contacted yet until he discovered he was chosen for the role of Spider-Man through Instagram. Did you know when Marvel Comics hosted a contest in 1982 for aspiring artists, they were shocked by the entry submitted by Randy. He submitted a concept art for a storyline that involved Spider-Man's upgrading his suit to all black from steel's purpose. After few months, uh, Randy received a response from Marvel saying that they would buy the idea for $220 and a chance to script the new storyline that featured his designs. Fact number 2. The dance that Baby Groot executes to electric light hit Mr. Blue Sky took 2 years to plan and create. This large product that took two years for the Guardians of the Galaxy 2 team to make with James Gunn paid off in the end as it was one of the most well-received scenes in the movie. Fact number 3 Boom! In 1984, the head of Warner's communication publishing approached former Marvel editor Jim Shooter for licensing the published rights to entire DC comic universe. DC refused the offer and continued to publish comics. Later on, DC became a hit with readers as Marvel hit bankrupt in 1996. Or else, Marvel almost bought DC. Subscribe my channel and give me some support.